Are we ready? Can we handle it? This laptop is f***ing crazy. This thing is fast. Super, super, super fast. The M1 chip in the MacBook is able to power through so many tasks with no sweat. OMG opening 50 to applications at once. You want silence? You can't even hear it because it's quiet as a mouse. Not only the performance, but also the battery life. It's so well optimized. Could this thing even handle 4K footage? Yes. It's just flying. You have next level. It's a beast. They just changed the game. Hello, and welcome to Apple Park. Today, we have some exciting announcements to share for the Mac. As you just saw, our users have never been more excited about the Mac, which has been revolutionized by Apple Silicon. With huge increases in performance and battery life, along with stunning new designs, the transformation has been profound. And combined with the power and ease of Mac OS, the user experience is unrivaled. We've already started the next generation of Apple Silicon for the Mac with the M2 chip, which has been a huge boost for the 13-inch MacBook Pro and the all-new MacBook Air. And today, we're going to bring M2 to the Mac Mini as well. Here it is. This is the new Mac Mini with M2. It's even more powerful and capable, and it delivers even more value. Now here's Aaron to tell you more. Mac Mini is the most affordable way to experience the Mac. And with M1, our users have been blown away by the astonishing performance it delivers in such a compact design. Paired with the studio display and magic accessories, the Mini becomes a mighty Mac desktop setup. And they also love its versatility. With its compact design and phenomenal capabilities, it's used in so many places, in so many different ways, from the home office to the studio, to build farms and data centers. In fact, Mac Mini has never been more popular. Today, we're taking the amazing Mini experience even further with M2. M2 features a faster next generation CPU and GPU much higher memory bandwidth, and a more powerful media engine for blazing performance. So you'll fly through everyday tasks between your favorite apps and be super productive. And Mac Mini with M2 powers through even more demanding workflows. Workflows like image editing and Photoshop are up to 50% faster than M1. With ProRes acceleration coming to the Mini, video editing in Final Cut Pro is over twice as fast. And the new Mac Mini is also great for gaming, running demanding titles like No Man's Sky at even faster frame rates. With this supercharged performance, the new Mini with M2 runs laps around the competition. In fact, it's up to five times faster than the best-selling Windows desktop. With all this performance, there's no better value than Mac Mini. Next, we have more exciting news. To tell you all about it, Here's Tim. M2 brings even more performance and capabilities to our most popular systems. It advances every aspect of the chip while continuing our relentless focus on power-efficient performance. Now it's time to debut the next chip in the M2 family. Introducing M2 Pro. M2 Pro cranks up the performance of our Pro systems yet again. To create our next generation Pro Silicon, we started with the supercharged building blocks of M2 and scaled up its architecture to deliver the powerful M2 Pro. Built using the second generation five nanometer process, M2 Pro packs 40 billion transistors into a chip the size of your fingertip. And its unified memory architecture, a hallmark of Apple Silicon, allows the entire chip to share its high-capacity, high-bandwidth memory system for incredibly fast and efficient access to data. M2 Pro delivers 200 gigabytes per second of memory bandwidth, twice what M2 delivers, and supports up to 32 gigabytes of memory. It features a next-generation 12-core CPU 
with eight high performance cores and four high efficiency cores for up to 20% greater performance over M1 Pro. It also has a next generation GPU with up to 19 cores, delivering up to 30% more graphics performance. And the neural engine is getting a big boost, speeding up machine learning tasks like video and image processing by 40%. Finally, the powerful media engine of M2 Pro rips through the most popular video codecs, dramatically accelerating Pro video workflows while using very little power. So that's M2 Pro, featuring a faster CPU and GPU, our next generation neural engine, and our industry leading media engine. It scales up the M2 architecture for incredibly powerful Pro performance. And the first product to get this new chip is one you might not expect. Back to Aaron. That's right. Today, we're introducing Mac Mini with M2 Pro. With M2 Pro, Mini users can now run high-performance workflows that you wouldn't think were possible in such a compact design. It's up to 14 times faster than the fastest Intel-based Mac Mini. So pros can do things previously unheard of on Mini. Musicians can produce music with incredibly powerful plugins and effects without missing a beat. Photographers can adjust huge megapixel images in an instant. Creators can work seamlessly in multicam with multiple camera formats, including ProRes video. And gamers can play titles like Resident Evil Village in console quality. In fact, Gaming performance is up to a whopping 15 times faster than the fastest Intel-based Mac Mini. It's phenomenal. So that's the new Mac Mini with M2 and M2 Pro. With much faster performance and incredible connectivity, there's never been a better time to experience Mac Mini. We gave the new Mac Mini to a team of creatives to see what they could do with it. So before I hand it back to John, let's see them in action. This is Kids of Immigrants. <laughs> Let's put this thing to work. So for us, it's really been building a community in tandem with building a brand. Bro, you got so many windows open. Real. That's it. Let's go. As kids of immigrants, we do everything with purpose and intention. Uh. <laughs> here, drop it there. Pull it over this way. Danny with the dance moves. And who Mac Mini? Woo! You about to go crazy with this. <laughs> <laughs> We're super excited about the new Mac Mini. Next, let's talk MacBook Pro. MacBook Pro with Apple Silicon has been a game changer. Users have been amazed by its powerful performance and capabilities they never thought possible on a laptop. Pros can work on projects that were previously only imaginable on a desktop. Creatives are stunned by its outrageous battery life, enabling them to work wherever inspiration strikes. They're also thrilled with its XDR display. Its incredibly high brightness, amazing contrast ratio, vivid colors, and outstanding viewing angle make it the best display ever in a laptop. And users rely on its extensive array of connectivity from Thunderbolt to MagSafe. And they love the powerful features of Mac OS. Quite simply, MacBook Pro is the world's best Pro laptop. And today, we're excited to also bring M2 Pro to MacBook Pro. And here's Laura to tell you all about it. 
Whether you're an artist, scientist, or developer, MacBook Pro is the go-to laptop loved by pros. And today, we're giving them more to love with even greater performance and longer battery life. M2 Pro delivers phenomenal performance for pro workflows. For instance, complex animations with dozens of layers in motion render 20% faster than before and 80% faster than the fastest Intel-based MacBook Pro. Compiling huge projects with millions of lines of code in Xcode is nearly 25% faster than the previous generation and two and a half times faster than the fastest Intel-based MacBook Pro, saving developers hours every week. And image processing in Photoshop is more than 40% faster than the previous generation and 80% faster than the fastest Intel-based MacBook Pro. For users pushing workflows to the extreme, we have more exciting news. Back to Tim to tell you more. Today, we're adding a third chip to the M2 family. Introducing M2 Max. M2 Max combines the incredible CPU performance of M2 Pro with an even more powerful GPU. And with the amazing power efficiency of Apple Silicon, it brings unbelievable performance and extraordinary battery life to our Pro systems. M2 Max has 67 billion transistors. That's 10 billion more transistors than M1 Max, and over three times the transistors in M2. M2 Max starts with a high-performance on-chip fabric with twice the memory interface of M2 Pro. This gives M2 Max 400 gigabytes per second of unified memory bandwidth. And its custom package now supports up to 96 gigabytes of capacity, 50% more than M1 Max. Just like M2 Pro, M2 Max has a next-generation 12-core CPU, which delivers up to 20% greater performance over M1 Max. And M2 Max has a much larger GPU, with up to 38 cores. Combined with a larger cache, it delivers up to 30% greater performance. It also has our latest neural engine and a powerful media engine with twice the ProRes support to dramatically accelerate media playback and transcoding. So that's M2 Max, a highly capable CPU and a monster GPU, support for massive amounts of unified memory, our most advanced media engine, and industry-leading performance per watt. It's the world's most powerful and efficient chip for a pro laptop. Now, back to Laura. M2 Max takes the incredible performance of MacBook Pro even further. Colorists can grade 8K video anywhere with DaVinci Resolve up to 30% faster than the previous generation with M1 Max, and two times faster than the fastest Intel-based MacBook Pro. Artists can have a mobile 3D studio wherever they go with effects rendering in Cinema 4D that's up to 30% faster than before and six times faster than the fastest Intel-based MacBook Pro. And with up to 96 gigabytes of unified memory, creators can work on scenes so large, PC laptops can't even run them. And its amazing battery life gets even longer with up to 22 hours. That's the longest battery life ever on a Mac. And MacBook Pro with M2 Pro and M2 Max delivers all this performance, whether plugged in or on battery. The new MacBook Pro also supports Wi-Fi 6E that's up to twice as fast as the previous generation. And with more advanced HDMI, it supports up to 8K displays. So that's the new MacBook Pro with M2 Pro and M2 Max. With amazing performance, extraordinary battery life, advanced connectivity, and the best display ever in a laptop, it empowers users to take their creativity to new heights. Before I hand it back to John, let's see what the new MacBook Pro can do in the hands of Pro users. Plug in three, two, one. All right, let's do it. 
I'm Sam. We're going to be filming a dancer and then work in some After Effects to do a bunch of compositing and fun transitions, hopefully, in the amount of time that I have. I'm Carl. I'm going to be trying to recreate a 90-year-old experimental lens design in CG, and then I'm going to make a cool scene using this lens. I'm Matt, and I'm going to do some visual effects and also work on coding my iPad app to do some explosions, fire, smoke, that kind of thing. So to start, we have raw data from this lens. Just kind of want to see what this machine is capable of, so I'm going to create a very basic explosion right now. I want to play with time, and I want to play with scale. Yes! We've been unplugged for, it feels like, quite a while now, and you know, I'm still at 99%, so I'm feeling pretty good. Let's see what that looks like. Oh, yeah, that's playing back real nice. Let's go high res. Oh, yeah, that's a lot of detail. <laughs> Just a couple of minutes, we should be able to start rendering through this lens. I want to do lots of layers, but the pressure's on, so I'm trying to control myself. I'm in modeling now, building a drone for a fish to fly. <laughs> Hopefully, this doesn't take too long. No, it's very fast. I have like 1.5 billion voxels, which for a laptop, never mind a desktop, is insane. It feels like desktop class performance. Compared with the M1, it's definitely sort of a noticeable increase, and compared with before that, that's uh, impossible versus possible. I don't have to now worry about if I'm going to run out of memory. I can just create. The machine will just kind of like soak it up and do it. It's cool, right? So then we can like move around you in 3D space. Mm. So now I'm going to be adding some new features to my iPad app. I have so many layers. I can't believe that this is still running. Uh, can I show you something? Yeah. I'm doing so much better than I thought I was going to be doing on battery that, like... <laughs> You've got free time. Sure, let's add this. I'm going to create a value that says set buoyancy. And let's run that. Make sure it all works. I keep forgetting that I'm working with 4K footage. Death to proxies. Look how fast it is. It's crazy. 38 GPU cores, man. I'm going to run out of time before I'm going to run out of battery. OK, we got a fish, we got a drone. Let's put it in a scene. I'm trying to apply one last effect. I get one shot to get this right. No mistakes. It's all going to be close. Yeah, that's looking pretty cool. Wait, why is it still wrong? Ah! Crap, crap, crap. Yeah, my heart is like racing. I'm working Make an explosion. Really yeah. really I know everybody bad. wants to go home. Oh. oh. <laughs> we got a render. Now I, as a user, can go ahead and have my fire be different colors. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm done. No, I'm done. <laughs> Review. Done. <gasps> Look how yeah. cool that looks. Yeah. Wow, get in this. Oh, yeah. That was stressful, but fun. <laughs> Super amazing what we were able to accomplish just on a single charge today. Imagine if we had two charges. The new MacBook Pro is more powerful and capable than ever. So today, with M2 Pro and M2 Max, we take Apple Silicon once again to the next level. Along with M2, they form the industry's most advanced lineup of chips. The new Mac Mini has far more performance and is far more versatile than ever. And the new MacBook Pro, with its powerful, groundbreaking features, simply has no equal. Together, they join the rest of our extraordinary Mac lineup with Apple Silicon, where we continue our tremendous pace of innovation. Thanks for joining us, and have a great day.